All right, get this. America spends more on its military than the next 10 countries combined. But what does that money actually buy? And is it really worth it? Let's break it down. First up, the F-35 fighter jet. This thing is basically a flying computer. Stealthy, almost invisible to radar, loaded with sensors and faster than you can blink. Each one costs about $80 million and there are hundreds in service. Now imagine a floating city. Yep, that's an American aircraft carrier. These beasts carry over 70 aircraft, have their own airfields and can launch strikes anywhere in the world. The US Navy has 11 of them, no other country has more than two. And it's not just planes and ships, drones are everywhere. The US uses them for surveillance and precision strikes, sometimes from halfway across the globe. But here's the real kicker. America's nuclear triad. That's nukes launched from land, air, and sea. It's a triple threat making sure enemies think twice before starting anything. On top of that, the US has military bases in over 70 countries. That means global reach, rapid response and influence just about everywhere. How does this stack up to rivals? China and Russia are catching up but the US still has tech scale and experience on its side. So, is it overkill? Or the price of being the world's top superpower? Let me know what you think in the comments.